Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Kipi Tesla. Welcome to episode three, <laughs> I think. Yep, it's three. We skipped one. Of uh, Resident Evil Zero. Hello, welcome, everyone, in chat. Hello, Terra. Hello, Mayo. Hello, Lyubka. Thank you for the resub, lovely sister. Yes, a whole year. It all started with... Uh, was it Blood Omen? It was Blood Omen 1, one when it started. Yep. And then you went through all of the Soul Reaver and Chrono, and now Resident Evil and Eternal Darkness. Whatever we did in the all of outbreaks. Thank you, love. Thank you. That's very good. Yeah. Double the hydration. All right. Hope everyone's doing good. Bon appetit, Terra. Let's get into it. Oh, another demo. Like Eternal Darkness. Start right in the zombie room. <laughs> Water. Okay, slot B. Right, Mayo. The, yeah, I was making syrup. I was, didn't uh, reply to all the messages. Mayo, I will. I will check it on Discord. If not tonight, if it's not urgent, of course. If not tonight, then tomorrow morning. I should have lighter work tomorrow. <laughs> so it should be a better day. Doing Ghost of Tsushima for two hours, then doing the new Dead Space. As in streaming? You're gonna stream those two? And uh, when was it again? I know it's soon. Your birthday. Well, yeah, nice. Okay, Luca, can we get a can we get a shout out for Terra? Playing New Dead Space as well. Oh, it's not urgent. Okay, all right. Tomorrow. Well, hmm. Well, in case I don't see you, happy birthday ahead of time. 13 hours. The countdown has begun. What are we doing? Yeah, we're, we're doing... Oh, yeah, shit. We're doing that. Come on, Rebecca. Let's regroup. Roger. I'm gonna need you to not die. As much as you can. It's, like, very appreciated right now. But I do want to minimize the bastards. Shotgun is too much. You know what? I got 12 Molotovs. Fuck it. So, I did unlock, going there. Hope you have a good one. I'm not even gonna... Actually, let's do it now. Pistol and explosive rounds. Not... Uh... ignore them <laughs> whatever they're doing just ignore them right attack I'm in charge all right they shouldn't be able to get in here ever so it's a good really good place to blow them up all together yep as I recall they can't pass this threshold There you go. Now I should be able to blow up multiple. There you go. One of them is dead. I think. What? None of them is dead? Yep. One of them is dead. Okay. They'll blow up another one. Hello. <laughs> blew them away into the next room. Back into the pool, you filth. Wait, there's more? Fuck it, why are we wasting bullets? Why am I... Why do I have the bazooka not to blow shit up? There were four of them, right? Yeah, that's it. At least we softened it up. I thought it was three. It's four. Seriously? Two. And two. Yep. Bazooka did great there. Explosive rounds. Too bad I didn't pile up all four of them, but there we go. Again, next time we'll know. Zdravo Eko, oh, nisam znao da ste tu. Zdravo Eko, zdravo dečice, Nina Gagi. Dobrodošli. Evo uvijek tamo ni bube. Ajde da, ajde da, da, da mi mama ne šalje poruku posle. Zdravo mama, iz budućnosti. I na okačić ovdje iza mene. Preko green screena da ide. Zdravo familio. 
what do we have here pistol molotovs okay billy you're on the cleanup detail which means you destroy comrade billy blow shit up he could pass yeah Kako je tamo kod vas eko, jel? Kod nas je padao grad jutros. I gore u Novom Sadu također, ne znam kako je. Ne, je probudio grad u nešto do osam. Mislim sam da je počeo rat. Ali bio je samo grad. Padao je 15 minuta i to je to. Alright, I gotta focus now. If I remember, it's very easy for the next guy to fuck me up, so... Let's split up. Okay. Room by room. These, this one's a little tricky because it can easily grab me. It can go both ways. But the safe was pretty recent, so move, move there. Yeah, I wanna be ready to come back. Actually, I'm gonna move like this. No, I think I gotta. Yeah, I gotta walk into him. There's something like that. He's there. <laughs> I remember. I didn't. If I go back, yeah, I'm just gonna trigger. Well, that didn't hit you. Oh, nope. It did hit me. I guess it counts. It's not Outbreak File 2. Don't have to equip them every time. Guess I can take one slap, sir. Now, do I wanna run past him? No, it's not Outbreak File 2. It's not Outbreak File 2. Oh, it cost me. I, wa I keep wanting to re equip the monsters. Oh. Just try to blow him up. That's it. Okay. That works for me. He blows up. I'm good. Yep. We're counting that. That was an okay encounter. If I didn't try to re equip the Molotovs, it would be a lot better. <laughs> Nothing in the window. Okay. Nachi Biograd. Ha 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 ha. Istira, istira. <laughs> These papers look like they once contained images of something, but they've long since deteriorated beyond use. So they were like surveillance pictures. There should be a yeah, somewhere here there's an angle. So there's nothing there really. But if we look as soon as I come here. See it looks like a map. It is a map. It's I think it's even a map of Raccoon City. Holy shit, that's a map of Raccoon City. Is that an is that an RE3 guide? Does it show where the facility is? Huh. Yeah, it's a map. I can see I can see Fisson Street down there. In front of the RPD. At least I think I maybe I'd see it because I want to see it, but it, it looks like it's there. It looks like yeah, there's the Raccoon Hospital, there's the park, there's the Dead Factory. Yeah, okay. It is the map of Raccoon City. Nice catch me. Is there another one here when I move? Oh, there's gonna be three or four mimicry marcuses now. All piled up next to each other. This tool will allow you to operate device, which we want. From the looks of it, someone was using these machines until very recently. I think that's where either that's either where Marcus was spying on us. Yeah, I think it's where Marcus spied on us because there it left a mimicry Marcus. That would make sense. Yep, <laughs> they're all gathering. It's the Smiths gathering. Yep, someone was looking them using machines. Not looking at them. They were using them. Well, they had to look at them. Their monitors, but there's nothing there. No. This one hasn't been used in quite a while. Okay, so that's broadcasting equipment. I forgot what's the name of this room. It says in the guide or in the wiki. But there's nothing there. Just like, just that vice. I wonder if I could have just slid past him. It's somewhat surprising the lack of uh, any supplies in the game. But yeah, again, it's RE0. It's supposed to be tough as, sh tough as shit. Okay, there's gonna be another mimicry here, I think. So, Rebecca, why don't you wait outside? I just want to make sure some nothing's gonna blow her up. She she takes, she's 
Her defense is weaker. Well, her HP is lower, actually. Shouldn't be destroyed by one mimicry, so... Then second quickly, I think I can make it. And then third, so I, and probably I'm gonna take another bite again. Better slap than a hug. Again, do not try to re-equip the fucking Molotovs. What is wrong with you? Okay, don't blow up all over me. That's never easy. These guys are never easy. Come back. Is it echoing back the sound from the TV? Because if it is, I'll lower it a little. I do like, like to hear, but I don't, also don't want it to loop back into... <sighs> okay, the next room. Shit, I can't remember if there are Mimicry Marcuses here. I think not. I think it's just gonna be zombies. Let's check it with Billy. How many? I have six more. I can kill two, two more of them, okay? I can work with that. We'll see what we need in there. He's got a better gun anyway. You don't hear the echo. Good, good. Because if you hear the game sounds twice, that means it's looping back. Oh no, this is pretty good. Okay, no enemies here. Come here, Rebecca. So this is what I was talking about in RE1. Actually, we can go together. Let's investigate first. <laughs> the piano is covered with dust, but it looks playable. Play the piano? Not yet. We're gonna save that. <laughs> the cabinet is stocked with small bottles. The dars there doesn't seem to be anything special about it. Bill is just chilling out. Waiting for Rebecca to finish her investigation. It's a nice bar. Looks like the bar room in RE1. I mean, probably deliberately. So check this out. Let's have her play. Oh, I think because Billy wasn't there. I think if I, if I, no, if I did this, let's go. Yeah. He would react to that. He would be like, "What the fuck is that?" Rebecca can play the piano. Yep, we got that. But let's split up. Okay. Actually, don't no need. But let's have him play the piano. So remember, in Ari one, Rebecca was practicing because Chris couldn't play. So if this was her. And this is Billy. Imagine how bad Chris plays. <laughs> That's a very nice painting. I gotta say. So let's switch to her. You as the officer do the investigation, ma'am. That looks like Magnum ammo. Yeah. He would react with... Oh. <laughs> well, they never got to the root of the problem in this version. <laughs> the shelf is lined with a selection of fine vintages. Vintages. Oh. We can make more Molotovs. Take that. And get the battery for outside. I like how you had to <laughs> look at it first. So that closes it, okay? 
Oh, there's something on the inside. It's a vintage. <laughs> but you can't read it. Too bad there's no first person mode. Would be nice to read. Help me, Billy! Play the piano again. He's so chill about it. <laughs> he still got the handcuffs though, remember? Alright, then Rebecca's out. We got the battery. While we're at it, we're gonna go use it. You know what, Billy, you go check it out first. I wanna make sure I don't blow her up or something. We're gonna get three more Molotovs from that bottle anyway. Actually, give me that. Oh. I guess she's not close enough. This way. Roger. Give me those bottles. And wait here. I'll go alone. Okay. Hello, zombie. Hello, my friend. Good day. Good evening, actually, for us. Please don't be a mimicry. Oh, geez, but there are these bastards. That's right. That's why. That's. I remember there was something here that... You know, it's, it's useless trying to keep him solo here. So let's bring Rebecca. Because I didn't bring the battery from her, but I also need her for this section. Oh, it's... Wait, really? You can't hear that? I can see that you can't hear it. What is going on there? Thank you for the resub, zombie. 14 months. Wow. 14. That's over a year, man. Listening to me. Talk shit. Day and night, but I'm um, just like... Oh yeah, you can't. Yeah, that's not through there. You could hear it. Okay, I just realized because because this. Never mind. <laughs> it it fucks up, often. So not there. I want there. Yeah, let's go do that together. Actually. How did it go? So the thing upstairs is good. We gotta push it out. I think. Let's go together. Okay. <laughs> you gotta get it's like trying to be older than someone who's already older than you, you know? <laughs> Let's go do the Where are the bottles? Down there? I think they're down. Oh yeah, there, there it is. That side quest, I don't know what to call it. Battery side quest, let's see. There we go. How much health do I have? Two spare, okay. Got two spare. And one of the plates already. We're gonna bring the other plate when we get out. Actually, there's nothing to kill outside, so that's good. As soon as I find the door, I'll get out. How's your day so far, zombie? How's your week, man? I think this is the longest we haven't played together. Yeah, definitely. It's been 10 days. Solidly built wire mesh. Despite its age, it shows no sign of the decay. Oh, it's very nice. Look at this. I love this area. But you'll see in a second why I called bullshit when uh, they said they can see forests outside. I don't know what's on the other side, but I doubt it's forest. <laughs> of course it is. Whose else would it be? The bridge has collapsed in the middle. Beyond the precipice, you see nothing but pitch darkness. So where's your forest now, Rebecca? Vareka. Let's get it down. 
There's no response. Looks like it's not getting any power. Now, how did that thing open after... How did it close and open after we took the battery? Is it like the bat secret battery storage? Is that the, what it is? Standard type battery. Can be used in case... In a battery case of the same type. Oh, Mayo, thank you for the raid, Mayo. Thank you so much. You were streaming and chatting. Wow, I sometimes I really admire your multitasking abilities. Let's see. Okay. What was Mayo playing? Where where are the mods? Where are the the mods? Mods are busy. Okay. They are doing shit. Mayo. Ha oh, okay, I guess it's not working. <laughs> Over at API error. Last seen playing API error. Wait, but we can do the. What was it? The new one. I forgot. I forgot the command. It was something like this. No? <laughs> yeah, it's the newest. Or was it just shout out? I forgot the Twitch command. Was it slash SO? Help me! <laughs> Mayo, what was it? Oh, yeah. It was slash shout out. Mayo Hazard. There we go. There we go. We have backup. Check out Mayo Hazard. Excellent games with custom soundtracks. <laughs> Resident Evil API Air. <laughs> you know, I can totally, uh, I can totally see that. Well, that's cool. Like, <laughs> shout out, join us in following Mayo Hazard, and it gives me the option unfollow. <laughs> oh my God, Twitch, you are you are an API Air Twitch. Oh boy, <laughs> join us. Oh God, that's just that's just horrible. <laughs> It shouldn't be there, but here we go. I guess if you shout out someone. <laughs> like, oh, wait, I don't like this guy. Let me unfollow him. <laughs> don't unfollow. Go follow Mayo Hazard. Uh, <laughs> with the API error and all. That was really good. I will say Twitch. Sometimes you really... you're. We don't need comedy streamers. We got Twitch here. Use lift. Yes. Ah, shit. Yeah, I knew I forgot something. When I was up with Billy, I always do it, but this time I forgot. <laughs> I okay, have to keep Alien redeeming those coming, for the love of fuck, Delmar. Hello, by the way, Delmar. Sorry. As you can see, Twitch is, like, really entertaining. Can I even... <gasps> Maybe I don't have to push it, but I, I'm pretty sure I do. Let's split up. Hold on. Roger. Let's split up. I'm going to go across the box. You stay on this side of the box. That's our splitting up. Oh, you don't... Cool. Never mind. Forget I said anything. Ugh. Hello, Teste. <laughs> How are you, Teste? <laughs> Yakuza New Beginning. Yes. Yes, that's the game. I forgot how, how long I have to push this. I gotta check it out. <laughs> uh, this far. Okay, I can go all the way back. That's right. I can push it all the way to the wall. Remember, could you just stand there? You're... Even though you can mix... <laughs> you can mix herbs, you cannot push boxes. It doesn't seem like... What do they keep in these boxes? Is it concrete? That she can't push it? Very flat boxes should be very pushable. She's getting bored over there. Dame Dane, is that like, oh, or is that <laughs> is that Spanish? Because <laughs> it can like from where I'm standing, it could be both English and Spanish, <laughs> with with just slight variations. Did I? Yep, over, over overshot it. Slowly now, Billy. Slowly, when when Billy pushes, she like he like push, pushes it into the next game. What's the next game? Oh yeah, it's Outbreak. Pushes it all the way to RE4. Man, the depth perception now is like I I feel like I overshot it again, but we'll see. Nope, I think it's perfect. Come on, climb it, climb it, Billy. Billy, don't fuck with me, man. There you go. Ah, okay. I still haven't played those. I watched my buddy John play them. I was like, okay, this is something I would like to play. But I didn't yet. <laughs> Which one is this? Discipline. A tablet <laughs> depicting a priest. The world. The world. <laughs> the word discipline is inscribed. There we go. We did say they turn to religion. They will turn to religion. 
very soon. This way. Roger. That's it. That's all here, right? There's no like bullets or anything. Too much. I'm expecting too much from you, RE Zero. Like maybe throw me a bone here. Even a bone, you know, I wouldn't. I wouldn't mind. I like bone is a weapon. I could club those zombies with a bone. Can't even escape. Well, isn't that convenient? Why didn't the mansion collapse in half, huh? How are you doing, testing? Are we ready? There's gonna be more leechmen to burn. Oh, I'll need the vice over there, but Magnum Ammo is here, isn't it? So there's really no... No, wait, where did I put that? Help me, map! It's probably upstairs. There it is. On the stairs left. Help me! Take it. And then drop it. One bullet. Still worth it. So, another tablet, huh? You know what? We could bring both tablets upstairs at this point. Billy, you got the first one, right? Take the second one. We're gonna drop them upstairs, because that's where we'll take them later. My lovely wife broke my last half liter glass out of, I think, well, several we had. So I'm back to the straw jar. I was hoping to drink from it like a glass, because straw is really annoying me. But uh, it just doesn't have the, the rim is not really good for that. It was made to be like screwed on and used with a straw. So I was like, okay, fuck it. You know when I'll find those? I'll, I know they're there. I left them. Still though. Very inconvenient angle. If you didn't know they were there, there was no map, they'd be easily missable. Okay. I do want to go back there and keep Rebecca in a safe room. Actually, not even maybe involve Rebecca in this, huh? There's gonna be uh, mimicry Marcuses when we're back. Can't remember exactly how. I think they spawn once you do the main objective. So I get Rebecca out of there before that happens. Yeah, go go go! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Silly, wasting ammo. Yeah, not yet. They'll spawn. I think they'll spawn once we're back from the. The other room down south. Something like that. Or maybe when I use the vice. Who knows. Let's go in there together. There's gonna be regular zombies inside to shoot. She's got enough ammo for now. We should be good. Not even the shotgun. Just use the pistol ammo. Shotgun's gonna be coming handy near the end. There we go. Dead already. Down, boy. That it? That's it, I think. Yeah? Yeah? It's a large drum. <laughs> Whatever was inside it is gone now. Ah, yes. The thing I don't have the weapon for. Actually, she could use some ammo. There you go, Rebecca. And you can take the shells as well. No, various machine parts. What could they have been building? Well, just like maintaining this facility, isn't it enough? Vice, okay, we'll do that. And that could be what triggers the mimicries. But I'm not gonna go ahead of myself. Let's try it, Billy. The vice is gripping the tablet. That's the third tablet. The handle is missing, rendering the vice unusable. Well, boy, are we in luck. <laughs> I 
that was a long loading for long loading period for such a short animation a tablet depicting a slave the word obedience is inscribed all right so we got all three of them now that's what marcus thought of his workforce <laughs> various tools and measuring equipment lie on the table so this is an interesting room for me but there's not much to find. I think, you know, inside the shotgun shells, there's nothing else. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Gee willikers. <laughs> what about the paper? They look interesting. What about the window? Tell me something. Like, why are you... They really cut down on exploration. I mean, as in, like, the flavor text. So, uh... I'll go alone. Okay. It was like... <laughs> that hand motion. Whoa, whoa. Okay. Ho let's hope I don't die. Should be able to kill them. It's easier with... Maybe I should have gone south first, but we'll see. Okay, yeah, that's later. That's later. Nice. So we get Rebecca to safety. That's after the last room, so to speak. We can... Actually, we can go both into the next room. Hmm. What I really wanted was to just zip. Run past it. Can I do it without her? I need a lot of space. Exchange. I think there's gonna be zombies inside. And the red and the green herb as well. That's why I think I might need her help. And then when we get out, I just run to the door. This should be it. This should be that simple. In theory. Something like that I remember. I know I found an optimal way to go through this. Let's try it. Ten bullets should be enough. But maybe not. Oh, I think I'll find bullets inside as well. Ooh. Should be good. I'll try I'll try my initial idea. Just run past and touch the door. As soon as I touch it, we should both be out. There's the bullets. So yeah, I will leave them for nothing. There are the herbs. She can on only she can uh, combine them anyway. And more bottles for more Molotovs. Somewhere there, I've seen it. Yep. That angle. Oh yeah, you, I I keep forgetting I can combine them as I um, as I'm picking them up. I gotta. Gotta get used to that. Is that good? Yep. We take the bottles as well. The floor is littered with bone fragments. You wonder if they're human bones. Well, look. judging by that skeleton, or pieces of the skeleton, possible. Almost all of the equipment here looks badly worn. Some of the machines are even showing traces of rust. Same. Don't open the door yet. Don't pick that up. There's an assortment of laboratory equipment. There doesn't seem to be anything of interest. Well, it looks like a boiler or something. Well, let's believe her. There's nothing there, just those things. I mean, that's enough, 15 bullets and all that, but still. Let's swap. Billy, take the lead. Let's just try to run past it. I think I did it like that last time, and I was like, woohoo! I can take both of them, yet I don't have to fight the thing. Ah, oh, shit! I was wrong. That should be it. Come on, Rebecca, please don't stay there. Sometimes they'll stay to fight for some reason. Yeah, okay. Wait, still way better than actually fighting the thing. He was waiting ready, so that one didn't mutate, like plop into a Marcus, like uh, some of them do. So let's go make more Molotovs and bring all the tablets. And start bringing the equipment. 
How did I do it last time? So I remember what I did was I brought all the equipment to the observatory right away so that I don't have to do that later. As in, I don't have to... I don't have to go back and fight more of the eliminators. So I'm gonna take some time to do this right. I think there are even zombies there. Let's go kill them. But do not put all the... Yeah, let's leave him here, Rebecca. Just leave it there. So I'll bring everything but the... What are they called? Tablets. Inside. And then when I'm done, when, I'm, when I transfer everything, then I'm going to use the tablets. Because once I do what I'm about to do, the path will change. And anytime I want to go back inside this place, I'll have to go past a bunch of elim eliminators. So I'm going to try to avoid that. Everything has to be inside the observatory. Let's get the shotgun first. Kill anything that might be in the way. Who's got the shells? I think Rebecca's got the shells. Yeah, I gave it to her. She also has the bottle to make more Molotovs. We'll bring that as well. And then we'll use the map to confirm we got everything. No, not that. Really good shells, okay, because what's because of what's coming, you're gonna need these. About 12 Molotovs, more than enough, I think, all the way to the end of the game. We got bullets. I actually give all the bullets to Billy. Save one slot. No no no. So we got three slots free with Rebecca. What can you bring? Let's start with the lowest floor. From there, I do want the hook shot right away. So let's go get that. I can't remember if some zombies or something respawned down there. Spiders, I've been through too many. Resident Evil sewers. Just in the classic games. But I think there's nothing here. Maybe a dream monster. No, it's too early for those. Was it here? <laughs> okay, okay, zombie. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was wrong of me to assume <laughs> that your people like to breed in the sewers. So, from here, we'll take something. Oh, we got one loose green. Good, good, good. <laughs> it wasn't me. But unlike in R1 Remake, you can't hold the button to make them, uh, you can't like in Argon Ring, you can hold A as you're approaching a climbable surface and they'll just climb and you can keep holding it and they'll get off. But here, it's not like that. So let's take that solo green. Where is it? We're gonna need some blues there as well, but... she full now? She's full. Okay. It's really a game that's not made for speedrunning. Or maybe it is if you really like a challenge, but you gotta plan shit. You gotta plan more than, well, more than in the other game, really. It's easy to get, to make a mistake and lose a few precious minutes. No need for speed, yeah. 
It's incredible how much I'm enjoying playing this now, as opposed to, you know, let me try this now. So what if I did, oh yeah, I can't, I wanted to combine them on the floor, but if I go combine with this, yeah, it just goes in, into his inventory. Okay, that works, why not? There are no zombies here, are there? I think there are a few downstairs. Actually, I'm pretty sure there are a few downstairs, but I could be totally wrong. Okay, no thanks. I guess not. That's where the tablets go. All right. So uh, just start dropping shit. As far as much as I can, I'll drop upstairs. Even. Oh, I gotta wait for her. Let's. Cause it's locked. The door is locked, but there doesn't seem to be a keyhole anywhere. A keyhole. The stuff is there, okay. So, you drop that. No, that. 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 Those are the things I want to drop here, okay. And then, Rebecca. Drop the hook shot. We're here we're gonna put together. So like here, drop the gas and you drop Oh, I already dropped them. I did? Okay. Oh yeah, I dropped them over there. That's right. That's right. Thanks, Lupka. Let's let's make another step. I think there's enough room here for most of our items. Drop that. You come here. Come here, boy. Who else would it be? Who else would it be? Hello, hello, Mark. How are you doing, buddy? Is your work day over? Can you rest? All right, everyone. Rebecca, throw it away. Okay. We go back for another round. Greetings, Franz. Oh, really? Nah, he, today he's working longer hours, I see. Discipline and unity are here, right? And then obedience is over there. Let's put these in. I'll check it out. Roger. But you can hold the button to open the door, just not to scale the surface. We really, I think it's like, not that they didn't want to do it, they just didn't communicate about these, all these things. I can imagine the development was already, you know, making two new games for a brand new console. That can be easy. Did I check this? There's a message carved into the control panel. The three fundamental principles of the Umbrella Corporation. So, discipline. It goes obedience, discipline, unity. Okay, doesn't matter. I think the order doesn't matter as long as you put them all. Full of what? <laughs> Full of chicken? Not, there's not... <laughs> what? <laughs> Darn that chicken spoiling the youth. <laughs> oh, Twitch. Come on. Roger. Let's go, Rebecca. Rebecca. Oh, what did I call it? Rebecca. <laughs> Barack and Libby. Can't remember which Resident Evil was it where they opened the, where the doorknobs are turning backwards. It's not the remake. It's not this one. It's not Code Veronica. I think it's one of the first ones, one of the early games. They just go backwards.
<laughs> you did say. Oh, I don't know what's behind those asterisk symbols. Rebecca, you're the ink ribbon coordinator. You go take that. You're also the, I guess, drug supply coordinator. Wait, I remember... We'll be able to come back here later if we want, that's right. Through other means, but we will be able. It's a bot, so uh, Zero doesn't have co-op. It's You control both characters, you can tell them, you know, to attack or wait, go with you, or, or you know, attack or idle actually, don't attack, go with you, or just wait, but that's like, those controls are shitty, I just used a button. You stay here. Okay. He waits. Follow me. Yeah. Yeah. And you can switch between them. There's a lot of puzzles you gotta do with both characters. Nothing but butt. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, chicken is a dirty word. No, not the pot. The pot. Not the ceramic pot. The... the whatever that is. Celluloid? Cellulose pot? <laughs> so we cleaned this floor. There's one blue. Oh, fuck it. I'm not gonna take that. Two blues up there. I, you know what? Fuck those as well. I don't know. Maybe take one. Spray's not taking any of those. I'll bring that. I'll leave those ink ribbons in case I need them when I come back here. It could be my safe haven. I don't know. I don't need... How many I have? 19. Yeah, I can take all the herbs if I want to. Who's gonna stop me? They're my herbs. Yeah, it does. By default, I think it's on... Was it in the chat settings? The little cog there? Shield mode. No, not the shield mode. But there are, yeah... There are um, profanity filters, I do know that. Switch to non-mod settings. Better not touch it now. Just I'll just leave it. I think two blues is more than enough. Shouldn't need them. But I won't need them here as either. I'm not going out there to those eliminators, so we're gonna check all the floors again. No, 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 okay. It did the thing. Yeah, I did the thing and it scared me, but it's not RE1, so it recovers from that. So, we'll take that, that's on our way. We'll leave these, just like maybe another survivor group needs them. Blue herb, leave it. These things, no need any of those. Here, everything I need is in that room. Except that shotgun that I don't need. It's over there, never gonna go there again. Molotov is there, handgun, ammo, shotgun ammo, gas tank. And the last tablet. Okay. Okay. So that's good. That's what I want. I don't want... So the point is, I don't want anything left south of this circle, which is the observatory. Because once I do my thing, the observatory is going to move down to this floor. But this room that would connect to the observatory, yeah, that room's got three eliminators. So I'm going to... My aim is to never have to return there again through that mean. So, mission accomplished. Let's go. That's it, right? We cleaned all the floors. The good and bad are in the balance. Let's leave this dump. Rebecca, you good? <laughs> I lost her two meters away. Mm. Good silk. Oh, apparently it was really in front of me. And lastly, the tablet. And then we go in. Anything that's outside the observatory, forget it. At least for a while. But this is what we need so far. Maybe I shouldn't have brought all of this either. Like the blue herbs and all that. Because it's going to be kind of be... Later it's going to be easier to get them from the, from the main hall. But that's okay. Just in case. Can't remember if there's anything poisonous up ahead. There shouldn't be. No spiders for a while, at least, but... 
kind of remember there being zombies here, but I think I'm, I think I'm thinking Leech Hunter. So let's get weapons. It's time. Shit, we're, he's like, oh, wow. We gotta start unloading. Where's his pistol? Over here. So you, Rebecca. No, he actually has the bazooka, right? He's gonna need that. And the flame rounds, actually. So you hold... She can't hold shit. Well, she can. Drop that. Nope, you can't leave anything. Okay. So, Billy, you gotta put that thing in. <laughs> start unloading. Yep, we gotta start unloading. Them. Dressing them. Undressing them. Fully. Uh, the tablet. Okay, at least I got one space. I can take the pistol and then we can exchange some items. I gotta bring everything outside anyway. Is it time for this to... Oh, wow. Yep. I, it just hit me. So I didn't play this on the GameCube in years. Well, I did last, last autumn. But yeah, I played the HD edition actually more. And I forgot about the disc. So be right back. Don't go anywhere. Just gotta swap discs. Already, they're ready for part two of their adventures. Now we're kind of submerged here. As you can see, the water is very close. So, as I said before, we gotta start downloading outside. Outside. Let's take something I won't need. Last things I'll take. Well, yeah, I won't need the pistol actually, but sure. What about you, Bereka? All right. Is there no eliminators here? I could be totally wrong. No, it should be the bridge. Yeah, this is the part that reminds me a lot of uh, RE3. Do I want to leave these here? No, leave them in front of there. Where I'll use them. There's the there's the reason for the titling of our episode. Well, not yet. There's more. Of course, there's more. All that shit there. The gas can can go here. That can go here. I'll drop the HP items over here. Somewhere where I can see them, of course. Along this railing. There you go. Can I leave more in, the, in this room? Okay, that's good enough, I guess. Can I mix it? I guess I could mix them. Oh, fuck that. Let's, let's get more shit. Well, now actually I just need what I need for this upcoming part, so let's think. What was the map select? Map select, change level, blah blah blah. Item list, that's not what I want. Start select map, there it is. Training facility. Not there, there it is now. Well, it's, yeah, it's on the second floor, so... I'll need, I'll bring one health, 
that's how much I allow myself to use. One health, the hunting gun, the shells, and the bazooka. Is that, can I bring all that? Let's go get the hunting gun. And she's gonna need some items as well. So there's the hunting gun, that's why I left it there. So that's three. The bazooka is three. Well, no, not the Molotov. I meant the shells, man. The shells. I guess I could try... Nah, it's never gonna hit him. So, exchange. Yes. What else can I bring? What else could I need? I'll need, yeah, I'll need the, the hook, the hook shot. What else do we have here? Two healths, both pistols and all the ammo. All right. How much space do you got, Rebecca? Should be enough. You know what? Leave the blues here. If anything, I'll need those last, if ever. Let's do more space. There you go. Because outside is full, really. Can bring one of these. Bring the pistols. Where? Wait. Still got three. He's gonna take the bazooka and he's gonna take the big health. There you go. That's all I'm letting him use. Correct? Correct, yeah. So shotgun shells, bazooka, and health. That's all he needs. And we got three more slots on her. Which is exactly for their pistols. And the ammo. Good, okay. Resident Evil, the item management game. <laughs> Inventory management sim. Alright, so... Yeah, we're good. You can equip your pistol. Just so we know which one's yours. But well, we do know. Phyllis has got a sniper. It's not a sniper. <laughs> the, uh, the optical attachment. Interestingly... So, the items that take two spaces in inventory, take two spaces in the map. Ma the map can hold a certain number of items. I know there's something to explore here. We can be like, oh, what's behind this here thingy? I love these, uh, like, windswept ivies in RE1 and remake in RE0. It really makes these houses look real. It's locked from the other side. Oh, whatever shall we do? It doesn't seem to be getting any power. Doesn't this part remind you of uh, RE3 zombie? Because it does me a lot. Especially this part. This view. Not this one, but this one. The music sounds like you just got out of a nemesis battle. And you're running somewhere, like to the park, I don't know. It gives me that feeling. With the wind and the thunder. Alright. I'll go. Okay. Why do you have to turn to each other whenever you tell tell each other what you're gonna do? Were there some herbs here? I'm gonna just do a quick sweep. Just in case. Actually I'm gonna put her where she needs to be, which is here. It's a very tricky spot to st stay on for some reason. But let's say she did it. So there are no herbs. Yeah, that's in the that's in the next one. Yeah, in the next hallway, I guess. Can I do it with one? I have to do it with one. There's no can, but I will save this time. I'm sure there's an ink ribbon in there, because if not. 
Yeah, there is. Because uh, this is the inventory I go in with. Now we'll see why is the episode called what it's called. There's an altar here. Despite its aura of divinity, you can't help but sense something ominous about it. <laughs> Again, like RE8. It's got that weird... Uh, it's a different style. What is it called? It's, it is kind of gothic. But obviously, you know... It's different than... I don't know what I could compare it to R7. <gasps> Excellent! Collision dish check sheet. First the shells. Yeah. Alright, pretty good, pretty good. Let's drop drop those. And take more. Since I haven't used any of these, I can just go wild. As long as I don't miss with four of them, I'll forgive myself. There's the ink ribbon. There are no notes. Very, very pretty room. The bookshelf lies in total disarray. Someone was evidently looking for something here. But they did that across the whole Spencer estate and the training facility. Alright, saving time. We got the bazooka, it's equipped. Only five saves. This is, I think this is my record for zero. I save a lot in this game because I always get confused where to go and it's easy to fuck up with the crazy RNG. But it went pretty well this stream. So we should be good now. Ready for the offensive. Yeah. Let's hope for the best. Alright, are we ready for boss number two? Hi, kitty. Hide it. She really knows her timing. Jeez. Bats in the Belfry is <laughs> a song by the uh, Annihilator, by the way, that I think of instantly when I see this guy. But it's an accidental BOW, it wasn't made by Umbrella. And this, I might reset 10 times here, you never know, so... Oh shit! Fast little bastard. That's okay. I still got you, bitch. I said I can miss four times, though. That missed, that's third, second miss? This should be good. Yeah, let's do another one. Damn. Take care of them quickly. I gotta hit the mom. No, that's not that's not the mom. Are you blind, man? Shit, they gotta run. Oh, good miss, 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 miss. As long as he doesn't get me still. How did that miss in the name of fuck? There we go, there we go, that was close, that was really epic. Oh my god, that was really good. He was about to pick me up again. Really good, okay. Good battle. Not the best, I gave it... 6 out of 10. <laughs> as far as this one can go... Perfect. I didn't use a single health, so I'm very satisfied. Whoo! Yeah, she's not. She's <laughs> so she knows. Like she like she knows the timing. Maybe it's because they can sense these things via I don't know hormones and other things. We can't even like they can hear our heartbeat. They can even hear our blood flowing through our veins. It's just like normal for them. So I wouldn't be surprised that like you know when I get I gotta stop saying like I started doing that a lot today. <laughs> uh, when I get excited 
or upset that she f feels it because she just rushed in here just before the boss battle when I got nervous she was like meow <laughs> Kentucky Fried Pussy <laughs> I don't know what that's supposed to be <laughs> You don't even have to try, my friend. It just happens. I love the hunting rifle, by the way. I said it before. I see a lot of people take the shotgun and drop the hunting rifle right away. I do the opposite. I'm like, fuck that. Don't don't pay her. <laughs> she is good. She's she's. I think she came to comfort me crazy little thing we did it okay I'm very good looks like you could use something to get up there a oh, good thing I brought my hook shot so if I left the hook shot I would have to go back to the facility but now because the observatory went down a level I would have to run through that second floor balcony that would be f just brimming with uh, what's their name eliminators so hook shot is now inside I think We don't need this for a while. Think what's left in there? Just the blue herbs? Because if so, that's all. No. No, Rebecca's got the shook hook shot. The shook shot. The shit shot. So all this left in there. That. Blue, blue, do blue. Two blue herbs and that. Okay. Yeah, I can work with that. Let's go, Rebecca. Come on, Roger. It's Billy, it's not Roger. Stop saying Roger. It's really annoying. Like, what if I called you Lily or I don't know, Jean? How would you feel? <laughs> don't, don't, <laughs> it's a thinker joke, huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Happy thinking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Keep saying Roger. All right, she's got all the pistols. You know what? I want my pistol back. I can keep this as well. Sure, that makes sense. Now I'll take some of that ammo. Well, actually, no, I want to save up. We don't need the ammo yet, so who is it? Billy, let's go. Shirley, you can't be serious. <laughs> I am serious. Stop calling me Shirley. <laughs> Man, I'll forever miss him. Leslie Nielsen. He made me laugh so many times. We can't both go up there, so. Let's split up. Okay. I'll be right back. No, it was right there. Uh, I always think it's right to the next to the altar. I am at the top of the church now. Wait, there's there's a higher point. Why can't I get up there? I want to scream like, yeah, <laughs> get up there and get hit by thunder. It's sad, it's a very short section of the game. Beautiful, look at that. Oh my god, it's gorgeous. I gotta let what's her face in. This circuit breaker appears to be supplying power to the elevator. Lift the handle. It says caution, do not Don't touch but you I don't think it says butt, but it looks like it says don't touch butt. Butt FIFA? Don't touch with your bare hands. What 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 is that word supposed to be? Oh well, I guess we'll never know. A scenic view of the lake can be seen from the cliff. What's that called? Reservoir Lake or something like that? I mean, literally, it's got 
no, it's got a different name. <laughs> a scenic view of the lake can be seen from the cliff. It's the same. Okay, same lake, same, same cliff. Nothing new, but I know there's an herb hiding somewhere. There it is. Zire de herb. And we got one green, so we can mix them. That's the one place where you find one red herb. Beautiful. Too bad we can't see more, but... Yeah, it's a cliff. Now, we're getting close to the part that I call bullshit on the most. Probably the most in all of RE. Well, no, RE8 got it. RE8 beat it. Without much effort, it just... <laughs> but yeah. When the laboratory from RE2 connects with this. Makes no fucking sense. Does she... No, she doesn't have it. Okay, let's go together. This way. Okay. Where did I put that? I think here? Yes, there you go. Try to take the green. Will she use use it? Yeah, I gotta try. Use combine. There you go. Instantly. And then you can pick up the other one. Then we gotta take all of this inside. So everyone's got their shit. Yeah? Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, now zero disc two makes a lot more sense because there's a lot of, a lot more of the game after this disc swap. In R one remake, it's like right at the end. Why would you? They couldn't fit it, and I think that's the best place they found to split the game. But it's sort of jarring. There's a stairwell here. You can't see. You can see a set of stairs leading up, but they have collapsed and can't be used. I always wonder what this says, but you can't read it. Maybe they never programmed it. Who knows? Okay, so I think he's got the bazooka, right? No, I dropped the bazooka. Okay. So I will drop this where it needs to be. This is the room I was talking about earlier. These, this guy will get up at some point when I do a key thing. This bookshelf contains a number of very uh, books about viruses. The titles are all unfamiliar to you. All right, Lubka. Did you see the? <laughs> did you see the bo the bat boss? Bat boss. Bat boss. Who did I give the bazooka to? <clears throat> I always give it to her because it's easier for her. That's right. So we leave that there. How many items do we need to bring? Oh, Rebecca, you're brimming. Like she's a like she's a container. You're brimming with herbs. Twenty-seven shells. So I got five and three eight. Is it enough to bring all the items? Let's try. So how many? Oh shit! There's a lot. There's a lot more than I wanted to. One, two, three, four. No, that's not it. One, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. We can combine those two. Okay, exactly. Everything will fit. Nice.
<laughs> Alrighty, we killed the giant mutated bat boss. It was an, exact, it was an excellent battle. <laughs> Where were you when I was looking for good puns for the stream announcement? I couldn't think of anything with bat. In such short notice, I was like, holy shit, I didn't write that. Usually I write them earlier in the day, so I have them ready. And I was like, oh, okay, I know the stream title is going to be Bats in the Belfry, but what the hell am I going to write there? <laughs> Mark, we, we talked about this. You got to you gotta take a bath more often than once a year. The viewers cannot be allowed to smell you, okay? <laughs> he knows. Oh my god, that was really good. We did, we did not <laughs> we did not talk about this, but it felt like we did. It felt as if we talked about it, honestly. <laughs> How did it go last time? I can't remember. Did you just say Beth? Get out of here. <laughs> we got some standards here. <laughs> uh, those are all good, I will say. We need a Z ink button. Did you find more bottles? I think, yeah, I think I mixed all the bottles I found. What else is here? I'm gonna ignore the blue. Get that. That, that, and that. Yeah, I, I'm ma we, we're making it. And that, that should be all. That went relatively painless. <laughs> Mark Marks in, in his element. Alright, Brecca, we need... You know what? We don't need those ink. I got 19 ink... Oh, I, I don't need those increments, so fuck them. Let's go, Libby. Not even the blue herb. Fuck that, too. What's gonna poison me? I am unpoisonable. Oh yeah, double elevator animation. <laughs> uh, blue herb. Yeah, blue herb. <laughs> okay. Blue herb. Blue herb? Reminds you what? What is he? What is he doing there? No, tell me about it. I'm sure it'll have nothing to do with bats whatsoever. <laughs> oh, really? Do go on, that sounds interesting. Can't use it, okay. Stolen's gonna be Beethoven, <laughs> Chuck Norris is gonna be Mozart. <laughs> Already said he, he'll be. <laughs> that is, uh, that is so horrible. It became wonderful. <laughs> Do we want? Yeah, give him all the ammo. She won't need any for now. I will <laughs> set her up with this. Is that how we do it, right? So I send Billy upstairs, and Rebecca stays here, because Rebecca can do the chemicals, yeah. Actually, I want to give her as much space as possible. When that guy gets up. I'll check it out. Roger. 
Kind of feel like I gave her the shotgun last time too. That makes no sense, right? Why would I give her the shotgun? Yeah, he just... Fuck it. Yeah, she keeps the shotgun. Not even... I'm not gonna blast it with... Uh, not even with the bazooka. Because I can't. When he takes... When he takes what he needs... We'll drop this here. Oh, il, il to moja majka preko Twitcha. Is that you, mother? Yep, it has to be. <laughs> Who else would have that username? <laughs> Pozdravo, majko. Šta li bi? Šta li bi da napravi nalog? Okay, so I want to drop, drop that, drop even that. <laughs> yes, the jedna jedina. Na koga drugo bi pomislili? A bring health, bring health. One health should be enough for him to bring. I'll bring this. Or was it not? Was it? Did I bring shotgun with him? Nah, that's that's exactly one one room too much. Zdravo, <laughs> mama. Well, there we go. My mother has joined the chat. Now she's gonna hit the fan. <laughs> so I got this. Uh, yeah, that's right. I wanna. Now here's when uh, inventory management becomes a little. I'm gonna drop that. Drop. Nope. Can't drop anything. But I need the shotgun. Come here. Come here, shoddy. <laughs> Norris will kick music ass himself. Yeah, he'll just kick. He'll kick it to play itself. She's got the right handgun? Yes. Leave that now. What do you mean? Because I dropped the other thing. Yep. Okay, take the shotgun. So the room is full. You can't you can you can only set drop a set amount number of items in a room and also set number in a single spot so now we gotta be smart about it as much as possible yeah that should be good equip her with that he's gonna have a friend as soon as uh billy does a certain thing and we use her to save here she's gonna stay here we're gonna split them up now you, you just have to there's no other way around this I think I got everything I need, so I need the pistol, the Molotovs, we're gonna have some Mimicry Marcuses. Yeah, that's good. I think this is gonna be enough. I got Molotovs in case they become, you know, too pushy. Or maybe just bring... Oh, fuck it, no, I won't bring the shotgun with him. It's gonna be just burden. Like this, I'm gonna say like this, yeah. Alright, here goes nothing. Oh yeah! Kako si majko? I will be right back. All ready, buddy. Good for you. Hold on. I gotta be ready now. Mimicry Marcus is here. Oh, okay. I guess not right now. Yeah, I forgot to read the file down there. So first, laboratory manager's diary. <clears throat> Today, under Director Marcus's orders, I changed the platform entry code. Later, I asked him what the source of the entry code was. He told me it was based on something significant in his children's growth. But the director is a loner. He isn't married, and he sure doesn't have any children. What did he mean? What did he mean? Well, we'll find out. Here's children. Through the hall, you can see the lower floor. But it's too dangerous to climb down there. Well, you got the hook shot, but I guess you're not gonna use it. Can't carry, but we'll bring it. We'll bring it. Hello, sexy Wesky. Hello, my friend. How are you? Haven't seen you in a few days. Have you been playing Forest? Yeah, okay, Mimicry Mark is coming. Let's get ready. Hotcha! Hotcha! Ow! Oh shit! Yeah, this is the this is what I hate the most. Then. 
Go! Okay. As long as I move now in time. Woohoo! Alright. Just one bite, not bad. Could have gone worse. Yeah, zero. Doing pretty good in zero, uh, Wesky, my friend. I am proud of myself. It was really going well. Is there gonna be another one outside? Because I'll need this. Yes, that's the map. Forest and Outbreak. Nice. Nice. Just a little bit more. So I've heard uh, my neighbors told me that Telecom Serbia called them to ask them about their internet. Shit, I should have called them myself earlier. But yeah. Apparently it's gonna be soon that I get good internet for that. What do I want to drop? I want to make more Molotov and it'll bring everything outside. I think I have this the room. So it's exactly two slots. The shelf contains a large number of chemicals. The labels are so dirty that you can't tell what's inside. Well, we got the empty bottle. These capsules contain human specimens. Each has a look of great suffering on its face. That's dark. A collection of leech samples. Press the button. Yeah. One of the capsules is glowing. We got the leech capsule. We got a good bunch here in the... In the stream of viewers, I mean. The capsule appears to contain a specimen of a leech. The lid won't budge. Maybe it's sealed with some kind of special material. Very detailed still. So it is sealed. We did find a file about this. Look how look how detailed that is. The resin that sealed the capsule. You could break the capsule, it's a glass capsule, but no, it's a resin table. We gotta we gotta do um, we gotta do a puzzle, of course. Which is why we love these games. We love puzzles. Puzzles is good. Let's make more Molotovs. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that, mom. Hey, Wesky, my, that, that's my mom there in the chat. <laughs> Just so you know. Wesky is a dear friend. Mark, I swear to God, if you make a dear joke, <laughs> I will end you. Let's take... So how much? I'm going to take that. Well, I'll have to come back here for something. It, like, whatever I do, I'll have to go. So I'll come back for the hookshot. Let's bring these two outside. And let's check if there's anything else here. Was there... Was there anything else? I don't think there is. The shelf is full of capsules containing various specimens. Now, I always think there's something you can go beyond there, but no. Like, the map tells you. It's a dead end. So that's it. I've taken everything that was in this room. Goodbye room. I mean, I'll be back pretty soon. The statue's upper body has been smashed to bits. Why? Is that representing something? It's time to release the hounds. Well, not really the hounds. The mimicries. Let's start dropping shit. I think I can switch to this. I'm not gonna have a mimicry for a while. Drop that. That I'm gonna bring. I actually shouldn't have even dropped. Ah, let it be. Let it be. I do wanna switch to Rebecca momentarily to read that file. Yep, there's another one. I knew it. Fucking. It's okay, we'll have to bring them down anyway. Okay. Oh, I never noticed that thing on the lock above the knob. Huh. Good detail. So we got... How many of these now? Six. We got some of them downstairs. Actually, let's check her. 
the guys are not up yet but you gonna you gonna live sir well later not yet what about this desk there's a radio old style radio there but nothing they want to talk about okay the file marcus's diary 2 okay so this is the sequel this page has been torn out trouble is unlikely but i close my babies up in a special capsule but it won't be safe if i hold on to it myself i'll hide it in that place to hide a leaf put it in a forest to open the capsule the special stripping agent is necessary no way spencer's lackeys could figure out how to make it so that's the page that was ripped off probably by one of the soldiers and brought here because we know what happened to them kind of like what happened to the wesker sub subordinate zombies in code veronica uh switch that's really fast loading speed gamecube that's like for a disc based system amazing it's locked you can't open it I can't open the door. Oh, yes. I'll take this outside because I'll send it to Rebecca, I'm sure. Am I sure? No, just touch it. If I find the red, then it'll make sense. Before that. Yes. More Molotovs. <laughs> Shit. God damn it. Should have left the leech specimen outside, but oh well. Because I'll need... Yeah, that's what I wanted to send outside. <laughs> zdravo Anči, zdravo Slestro Slatka. That's supposed to be like based off of Master Roshi from... Uh, <laughs> from... Uh, what's his face? Dragon Ball. Leave. Right, I think I got everything. Tell a family I too. It looks too high to jump down. You're too high to, to jump down. Oh yeah, what key do we need for that door? So this is where I want to drop. Well, actually, no. I want to. I want to keep carrying it. That's right. I know why now. First, this door here. It's locked. Second, this thing. It's gonna be scary for a second. There's a button. Press it. Well, not yet, actually. What is this? Nothing. Okay. Now press it. So this is... Because you're safe here, for now, this is where I normally just stand around here and listen to the music. Because I love this track a lot. It's a short one, but it's really... I think that's what they tried to do in Outbreak, in the Hive scenario. When the Leechman appears, there's similar string music. It's not like this, but they were uh, definitely alluding to that, at least. But you're safe, because he's below us. Rebecca has to take care of him. And then it loops. Very, very nice song. Or even trash. Okay, I... I forget when she's gonna get attacked, but I know it's... I think as soon as I open the gas chamber, we'll hear from her, probably. I'm gonna keep checking on her from time to time. What, that one bullet? Really? Sir? I expected more of a challenge, but oh well. More documents to read. Leech Growth Records, February 3rd, 1978. Here we go, we get clues now. Administered tea into four leeches. So four, important. Their will to survive leads them first to parasitism and predation. Then they breed and multiply. Such a single-minded biology makes them attractive candidates for bioweapons research. Afterwards, no major changes observed. I'm just taking he was already old when he was writing this. He was, he was an old man when they killed him. February 10th, 1978. So this was February 3rd, then 10th. Seven days since administration of tea. 
rapid growth to double former size, signs of transformation emerging, spawning successful. They double their numbers in one hour, but their ravenous appetites lead them to cannibalism. Hasten to increase food supply, but lost too. March 7, 1978. Provided them with live feed, but lost half when the live food fought back. However, the leeches are learning from experience and are beginning to exhibit group attack behavior. They are also seizing cannibalism. Their evolution is exceeding expectations. April 22nd, 1978. The leeches no longer exhibit individual behavior even when not feeding. They move as a collective. They consume everything I offer with remarkable efficiency. April 3rd, 30, 30th, okay, I, this is a new one. 13th, 13th, how do you, you can't pronounce that, it should be 30th, but okay. I, I think this is, this, I think, but I'm not sure, this one is not in the HD edition, and in version 1.0, we'll see. <laughs> oh, April 13th. An employee has stumbled into my experiments. Can a human be a food source? How will the leeches respond? June 3rd, 1978. A day worthy of commemoration. Today they began to mimic me. Surely they recognize their father. Wonderful children. No one will take you away. All right, sick bastard. Oh yeah, that was like, he's the one who turned the progenitor into T-virus. The first version, the first breed. The, 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 I already mentioned this, but the strain that contaminated this facility and the Arclay Mountains facility and the and that later contaminates all of Raccoon City. That's the Epsilon strain. So that's like what the seventh, eighth edition already. <laughs> January of Van Skate. So yeah, he started this in 1978. Or actually, he had a breakthrough in 1978. He's been experimenting since the 50s or 60s with Spencer, which we'll see in RE5. Well, not in RE5. In RE5 loading screens. It's full of poisonous gas, so the safety lock has been activated. It appears to be a device for pumping gas into the room next door. The device is empty right now. Well, there's also a red one here, but yeah. If we sent Rebecca up here, it looks like some kind of chemical. You'll need a container to carry it. Okay. So this guy will also get up at a very uh, unpleasant time. It's been replenished with fresh bio-organic fluid. <laughs> the surrounding equipment is running. No, it's not. It's standing. All right. Okay, we're going to open uh, exchange now. We'll be able to exchange items. As soon as I kill these guys, I think there's several of them. He's getting up. Eight bullets. Okay, should be enough. That's not good. Oh, that is good. Okay. I can work with that. Actually, fuck it. Live reload. The way I like it. Which one is getting up? Army man. Get up. Get the fuck up. Billy's upgraded pistol is the shit. Anything else? Nope. Nope, nope. Touch it. Don't take it. This operating table has been overturned. It looks like it happened just recently. Alright. Alright, clues. So this is never said in the cutscene, but I think this has got something to what happened to Marcus recently. He's been... We'll see. We'll see about it. Investigators report. Dr. Marcus, co-founder with President Spencer of the Umbrella Corporation, disappeared 10 years ago. So he disappeared in 1988. There you go, 10 years after his breakthrough. The result of his research, results of his research have been kept under wraps for all that time. The reason became clear here at the training facility run by Dr. Marcus. Well, not here exactly, but underground. 
When we ventured below, we understood. There we found the evidence of Dr. Marcus' research into the T-virus prototype called Progenitor. The evidence of years of hideous experimentation that used company employees as guinea pigs. We cannot know how many were forced to become test subjects. Just subjects. But based on the evidence, no less than 20 individuals were involved. Some of them taken deliberately to keep the corporation's secrets safe. Where the doctor is now, I do not know. But, considering the recent rapid growth of Umbrella Corporation, I can't imagine that his research, that this research is continuing. So I can't imagine that this research is continuing. I think that's the opposite of what they wanted to say. <laughs> Joseph! No, his experiment... See, I can't imagine that his, this research is continuing, but then he says, no, his experiment lives and continues to grow in the dark. It's like confusing. I think it was, it's a case of mistranslation from Japanese. But anyway, those things, the fruit of his research, they filled this facility. The rest of the notebook pages are missing. Investigators report. We got it. There's some kind of mysterious thing on the operating table. There's a lot of things here. The sink is old and rusty. It also, it's also covered in filth. Looks like some kind of chemical. Yep. It is, Billy. It is. But you're, you're not equipped to... Um, to do that. This door is decorated with a bust of Marcus. There's a space in the base. There's a space in the base for some kind of object. Well, can you imagine what kind of object that is? You'll never guess. <laughs> Anything here? The shelf is lined with a variety of different chemicals. They look like they're used for surgery. Surgery, you say? Oh, this one's different. The shelf is lined with a number of poisonous looking chemicals. All of the labels have been ripped off. Ooh. Alright, so now we got means of... Uh, <laughs> we got means of uh, communicating. Let's start. Simple elevator for transporting items. It appears to be connected to the library. Send something to the library? Yes. This is kind of... This is a... The second most nonsensical thing in the game for me, so check this out. As soon as it does its thing. So switch to Rebecca, back to the library. So this is where the library is. This is her. So there's the library. There's the operating room where the blue arrow is. So how the fuck does that elevator work? How does it like go up, then left, then up? How there's there's not even walls. It has to go through the through the floor or something. It makes no sense. It's one of those things that you can see the game was rushed, which is it's not really a th it was the opposite of what we expected from a Resident Evil game. So I think that's that's some of the some of those disconnects is what bothers a lot of fans. Okay, so now we gotta do her bit at least for now I don't think there's anything else I can do with Billy right but I do need the bazooka the bazooka grenade launcher I'm sorry I just keep calling a bazooka that model because of RE1 drop the you know what drop the pistol for now but do take those flame shells rounds Napalm, napalm grenades. Yep, there you go. We're gonna burn us a uh, mimicry, Marcus. Not even health. I don't think I need it. So from here, yeah, I'm gonna wait for him and just. Well, not with that weapon. Not with that weapon, you don't. That's where we opened the wall earlier, or whatever you wanna call it. Come on. Come on. He's gonna mutate as soon as he sees us. There he is. You see me, buddy. Come on.
You can see them explode now. Just a puddle of leeches. Alright. The painting depicts a woman embracing a demon. Okay, so yeah, that's what we need from Billy. That's right. Nice. Make a mix. Don't need that for now. So I'm gonna drop it there. I'm gonna make some health. I guess I'm beginning to like this game more with age because it got that strategic element to it with inventory. It grew on me. It really did. Two years ago, I would even consider this skipping it in the marathon. So what do we need to make? Let's check them both. Options. No, uh, no. Again, why do I go to options for files and map? <laughs> file. 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 Chew. Alright, we got all the files there. We need some more here, but that's okay. It was first investigation unit notes. And th there's a note at the back. So red and blue. Sulfuric acid. Green and red stripping agent, which is what we need. That's why I brought green from the back there, from the from uh, from the main house. So we have the green chemical. We're gonna take the red chemical as well. Looks like some kind of chemical. Put it in the mixing set. Yeah, the green chemical is already in your mixing set. Add the chemical. So it's green and red, right? Yeah. What could happen? The red chemical and green chemical have been mixed to form a stripping agent. Exactly what we need. Stripping agent used to weaken the grip of certain types of materials. Let's not forget to equip her. Because she'll need that if that zombie gets up. I think it's also going to be a... Is it going to be a leechy room? I can't remember. The straw would be a lot sexier if it was, you know, bending. Let's go back to Billy. And send the thing, which is... Where did I leave it? I left it back there. Oh wait, is it in my inventory? It's in my inventory. I was smart. Yes, I was smart. Send something to the library. I thought I had. So you can imagine how hard this is when you don't know much. Remember, I beat this game twice last year. Unless you're like a speedrunner or... A streamer who plays a lot of Resident Evil or just you played this game often, you're gonna get confused easy. It's it, it was just built that way. There's something inside. You can't shove a shotgun or or the grain launcher in there, so that's why I had to think twice before, you know, what I'm gonna bring with Billy. They're gonna be separated for a while. It makes this game really interesting for me at least. Use or no combine. There we go, we got the blue leech charm. A blue sculpture specially shaped in the form of a leech. Alright, let's go. I think she's gonna yeah, she's gonna see something interesting back there. We got the blue blue one. Blue ones for downstairs. Okay, just wanna make sure. Yeah, this door. I didn't even check it, but yeah. There's a device for entering a combination, but it's missing a part and can't be used. So for now, this is useless to us. Let's go open the blue door. This door is decorated with a bust of Marcus. There is a space in the base for some kind of object. Well, what kind of blue object could it be? Oh my! The lock has been released. So let me remind myself, I think... Ah, yes! Okay, we're gonna see a, an interesting cutscene now. This room. And this music. I really like this room and this music, honestly. A large painting hangs on the wall. The title reads, Woman in Love, 
with a dead man. What is that alluding to? It's just like background. Mysterious, ob mysterious objects are floating in the water. Okay. There you go. You got some ammo. We can send that to Billy. To Libby. Look at this. It's so, so nicely decorated. It's an unlit fireplace. Looks like it hasn't been used for a long time. I wonder if Billy can uh, light that. I'll try it later. I doubt it, but just to check. Skeletons in the... There you go. That's... That's, is that an actual skeleton or a doll? I just gotta say it's a doll. Here we go. Cutscene time. Take the input regulation coil. Uh, yes. There's something else here. A photo. There's something written on the back of the photograph. To James, to commemorate your graduation, 1939. Took the old photograph. Like James, Mar James Marcus. <gasps> that guy must be Marcus's son. Or grandson. So she's concluded that the guy we've seen singing on the hill to the leeches is Mark James Marcus's son or grandson. Because James graduated... In 1939, which was already 50 years ago. Dr. Grza. <laughs> Grza ya Marcus. <laughs> I gotta tell him that when he comes over. Do I need? Yeah, I got one more space. Sure. You know what? Drop, drop the bullets. Let's check the regulation coil. Necessary to get the cable car moving again. How do you know that? We haven't been there yet, but okay. I'm not gonna push you, Bereka. Bereka? <laughs> Bereka. You're a Bereka now. Who's first? Who's first? I hope my shotgun's loaded, otherwise, this is very stupid. All right? That works. Sir, please. Oh, that was really, that was good. I got some good clips tonight. I just got to remember to clip them. The one with the bat killing, I got to write that down. Bat killing, and I like this one. <laughs> just like decapitation. This picture is composed of four separate sheets. There doesn't seem to be anything special about it. Decapitation. Oh, look, it's the thing from the Spencer Mansion. Remember the puzzle we did in RE1 Remake? There it is, the bird on the branch. Very nice. Do you, so you need the blue leech to get to the green leech? To, you know, to continue on. That's it here, right? A variety of expensive looking art supplies. For some reason, just looking at them sends a chill up your spine. Why, Rebecca? Despite a few cracks, this pot looks like a valuable work of art. Where, which, which pot? Oh, that pot. That's a pot. I thought that's a fireplace. You can't, look, it's really wonky speeding text up in, in, in this, just like in the first RE1. This jar looks like to be an antique. It's full of dust. So that's how you decide that, huh? Yeah, as you can see, they all have umbrella fatigues on. Now, how did they get here before me? It's a good question. How did they get here without the leech, I mean? That was still sealed. Alright, we got enough room. Just enough. Isn't that lovely? I think when I release the gas, Rebecca's gonna get bitten. Or like at least they'll they'll try. They'll surely try. Do I wanna drop something while I'm here? 
Uh, don't drop it. Well, it's good. I'm gonna send these two to Billy anyway. Already ate it. A uh, twenty. Damn. Okay, I'm having fun with the game, obviously. Is he up? Oh, he's already up. Okay. Wait, really? Where is that zombie? Did he just get up and walk away? Because I wasn't there? Did she kill him already and I missed that? I think she already killed him. I just didn't even notice. I mean, it's kind of weird I didn't notice a body that body here but he's obviously not there anymore so uh gg i guess away it goes <laughs> Really? I thought it got, comes later when I release the gas with Billy. But I was wrong. See, Billy still got corpses behind him because I didn't get out of their room, so it actually memorizes that. They only disappear once you leave the room with a character. With both characters, I mean. Unlike the one in the train, the dumbwaiter, this one, you don't have to call it first and then send things. I guess it's more of a teleporter than a lift. Seeing how uh, it, it <laughs> bends the time. Time and space. Well, space. It's bends bend space. Probably time too, because it's right there. Is she fine? Yes, yeah, she's still fine. He's cautioned though. I did get bitten. If they attacked him, I would hear that. He'd let me know on the radio, so... Green lead charm. Okay, we can open that door now. Green sculpture specially shaped in the form of a leech. Specially? Like, how else would it be? Casually shaped. <laughs> Lock has been released. Let's check now. Kind of think there's something screwing with me. Nope. I think she did it. Oh, it's the crawlers, okay. I can deal with that. But where? That's it, okay. Gee, you can see their feet. These containers look like they are are used to store dead bodies. A strange strange smell emanates from them. Right? I mean smell of dead bodies. Gotta love that foot sticking out. You got a comment for that? The foot of a corpse is sticking out. <laughs> okay, fair enough. The rest of the body has decayed beyond recognition. But how? If it's been there for over ten years, makes no sense. Is this guy gonna bite me in the foot? Oh, he's alive. Look at that. Look at his head following me. I wonder. Yeah. 
Here you go. I saw that. I saw you following me. Anyone else? Did like five of them is gonna come to life, huh? Not yet, not yet. I wanna see what else is there. Ah, yes. Ninety. Okay, now at the end of the game, when I don't need them, I got ninety. Good. It's a corpse in a body bag. You get the feeling it was just stuffed in there. What does it matter? It's umbrella, I mean. They didn't meet a, you know, a happy ending anyway. Sterilizing agent. A small tank containing a chemical agent that can be used to sterilize rooms with con contaminated by a virus. Let's actually look at it because only we only have it for a short period. Very detailed. Again, I'm, I'm just impressed by these details. You can't read the text on the label there, but that would be like expecting too much. Alright, I guess nothing's gonna come out of these. Oh, look. Really, nothing's gonna come out of these. Okay. Maybe if I didn't kill that guy, he'd come after me. Who knows? Let's, let's just not find out. See, this is where I expect him to bite her, to at least try. You mean lonely? Okay, I'll get, have to check the VOD later, see if there was a corpse that I missed. Like, how do you miss... How do you miss a ventilated zombie? I guess if you try. Alright, they'll be up any second. 11, that's, that's enough. I could even do that. Why not? Have fun. No, actually, I do want them for the ending. Yeah, save those for the final boss. It's lonely what you're looking for. It's not cricket. <laughs> Can I just... Can I poke him? Nope. He doesn't care. Until I open the room. And then I gotta run. What is it, Zamboni? Yep, that's what I expected. I am a marine. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Nice. Now switch to her. See, I swear this is where it usually attacks me when I do that. Maybe it glitched and disappeared. Who knows? I mean, she had the shotgun. She defended herself. It's all good. That's all that matters. She's alive. It's weird, I've never had it happen like that. Usually, in the first few runs, it bit me because, you know, I did not know that. <laughs> I didn't memorize it the second time, but the third time I was ready. Take the breeding room key. Yes, okay. This is why I brought the health item. Hopefully I, don't, I won't need it, but we'll see. A key engraved with the visage of a hideous monster. I mean, it, it's a lion. A little exaggerated, but still a lion. This key looks like it belongs in wild things, don't you think so, zombie? It's kind of hard to handle like this, but oh well. Appears to be a device for injecting gas into the room. Oh, it, it, it disappeared to be a device for pumping gas out of the room. Nice. They thought of everything, except when they didn't. Is that it? Yeah, that's for me. That's for me. Okay.
I'm so hungry. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> uh, I watched the movie a dozen of times. Exactly why I keep saying <laughs> surprise, cockface. Okay, let's focus. Gonna be hunters here. But not until, not until I come to them. Fuck you. Why would you? Why did you aim there? Are you fucking? Okay, one of them is dead. Good start, good start. I might have to. No! Oh. Okay, good Billy, good Billy, Billy the soldier. Oh, wow. Die, please. Fuck you. Oh. Alright. I did aim for the penis. You got that. Oh, that could have gone worse, but it's okay. Just maybe 20-30% of HP. BOW report. Research to date has shown that when the progenitor virus is administered to living organisms, violent cellular changes cause a breakdown in the system. Furthermore, no satisfactory method has been found to control the organi organisms for use as weapons. Clearly, greater coordination at the cellular level is essential to enable further growth. I conducted a number of experiments in an effort to find a breakthrough. This is my report. Oh, this is this is actually, this is um, you mean cloaca maybe? <laughs> this is this is old Marcus, insecta. Perhaps because these ancient animals have been genetically stable for millennia, when administered with the progenitor virus, they exhibited only explosive high energy growth and increased aggressiveness. It is extremely difficult to envision using them as BOW. So this makes sense. This is where the the plague crawlers, the you know huge mutated, they're kind of mixed cricket, spider, and a few other insects that he experimented with. <laughs> this cloaca pleases me. <laughs> uh, what else? We had the the centurion, the huge ass, uh, not caterpillar, centipede boss. We had, what else was there? There were some insects in the mansion, I think, as well. Yeah, the spiders, the spicer, spiders in the basement. And uh, these latest ones are probably uh, accidents. Like, we know the centurion is an accident. It just got infected, probably ate infected tissue. The centipedes are carnivorous. So it could have eaten a dead zombie dog or a zombie human and gotten infected, something like that. Amphibia. Injecting a frog with the virus resulted in an increase in leaping power and abnormal tongue growth. However, no change in mental ability was observed. Furthermore, an abnormal appetite resulted in the test subject randomly attacking all moving objects. Usefulness for BOW is limited. We'll see them as well. Mammalia. The progenitor virus was merged with monkey cellular DNA, resulting in increased fertility. The resulting young exhibited improved aggressiveness and some increased mental capacity. As a side effect, visual power was lost, but this was offset by an improvement in hearing ability. However, they were unsatisfactory as weapons. It does seem that no progress can be made without making humans the base organism. Which is how he got from the progenitor to the T-virus. The iron grill has been ripped out. Whatever did this must have been fried, frighteningly strong. Aha. Uh -huh. There's the dial. Looks like an ordinary dial similar to those found on safes. This cage is about the same same height as a human. You wonder what they were raising in there. Well, we know that Hunter is a mishmash of a mishmash, a mix of a human and reptilian DNA. We know that that's for alphas. The betas are slightly improved, 
and then gammas are a mix of amphibian and human. Actually, this time human and amphibian. They change the host and the donor. A number of broken cages lie stacked up. They all bear traces of having been smashed open from the inside. So, like, all of these guys escaped, and did they open the door that was locked? I need more. A donor. <laughs> Let's send this to Rebecca. I think that's about it for this place. We're going, re we're really progressing. For Resident Evil Zero, I'm more than satisfied. So that lost stream on Tuesday isn't such an issue because... Uh, because we didn't... We're going to finish it by Friday. We're still on schedule. No, it says they, they've been smashed from the inside. So nobody let them out. <laughs> Unless they came inside with them and <laughs> break, <laughs> broke the cages from the inside. Well, I wouldn't be surprised. There were uh, fanatics in the Umbrella. Does he need anything? He doesn't need anything else. Okay, so I can move him from here. Out of the room. Possible, yeah, but the key was... You'll see this, the rest of the story. The key was... Um, maybe they ate each other. That's more possible. How are they still in there is a good question. Knowing that... Well, James Marcus disappeared 10 years ago. <laughs> how, how are they alive for 10 years? This is the RE game with the most plot holes. But if you can ignore that, you can have some fun. As I'm trying to do right now. How much? Oh, exactly what I need. No, the door is here. We'll need that in a jiffy. See that thing, it has, I think it had a lock that was melted right above the doorknob. Alright, so that's it for Billy here. It's time for her. I'm gonna check the room now. Did she fight something? Because if she she got attacked and she couldn't handle it, she would uh, call call me on the radio. I mean, call Billy, but yeah. Alright, now we got the dial, now we just gotta figure out that puzzle. His children's growth. So we know he was talking about the leeches. The man was in love with these leeches. Nope, it's not here. I can bring one more thing. If I could bring one more thing, what could what would it be? It just health, I guess. I think I'll need for the other thing before we move on. Uh, again, why do I keep going to options? I guess because it's the first thing. File. All right, we got all the we got the first. Good. Okay, we'll get all the files. I think it was first investigation unit notes. So sulfuric acid is red and blue. All right, let's get that, and let's also check the the hint leech growth records so started with four doubled to eight so four eight lost to four eight six three that's it four eight six three The device is working again. Enter a combination, yes. That's right, rotate a button enter. So it was four, eight, six, three.
There we go. The door is now unlocked. Can I bring anything else? I could bring one more thing, but I'll be back anyway. So wait, wait, I left one. Yes, I left one herb mix here. Now I gotta start dumping this shit. <laughs> Downstairs. <laughs> those two those two words in one sentence. Nope. Now this is more like it. Billy here. Billy, I found an aerial Do you see that? We can get out of this place. Good. Wait there. I'm coming. Roger. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Out. She is Canadian. But she's what she did there under the railing. Yeah, you can't do that in the game. Like, why could she do it in the cutscene? I can't do it here. Silly. Real silly. Alright, let's drop. Let's start dropping health. Actually, health over there. I want to see where the bazooka and other shit is here. Where I need to, you know, make sure it's very visible. I'll need to bring this up here. Later with the hook shot. <laughs> yes, love, exactly. <laughs> hey, this is this is a little gate in my way. I could easily jump forward it, but it's like not like giving me the jump forward command. What should I do? Ah, you have to go around and find the key. <laughs> oh my that's one of my favorite eager after jokes very fast and very true one <laughs> look so this is really cute i think yeah you can climb up here look there's no purpose just because you can why why would it not let you see what we have here this is where billy is but he's on the other side i have to move this shit and you know get them together there he is <laughs> but it does allow you to you know go up and see for yourself it could be, it very well be, oh no, it's too dangerous to climb now, or something like that. Bella! <laughs> she does call him like that. So there's not, a, I'm gonna not gonna need the shotgun for anything right now, so I'm leaving that here. You can go for the rest of the items together, I would say. thinking whether I yeah oh that's okay okay very good a few items are upstairs that's okay with me she's the bazooka master so let's go get that Billy what what is up there with you herb I think there's let's check the first taste spray I don't need so that's right here and that's here just two items okay good Let's get down there, buddy. Bring that. Maybe bring that as well. Hmm. Or actually, we'll bring the other one here. Maybe that makes more sense. That's one item less, in a way. Well, no. Since we gotta bring it anyway, it doesn't matter. Oh, I have no room. Reasonable. Do I want to keep the Molotovs on him? I think I want to keep Molotovs on him. She's, I'm not going to need them with her. I'm not even going to handle them with her. It's... I'm trying to remember. Is there any Mimicry Marcuses where we're going? They will split up again, though. I'm going to leave him on him. So not even Billy. You know what? Just go down there. We're going to exchange pistols as well. So she gets the better pistol. Not gonna talk about that. What about that? It doesn't seem to be getting any power. Okay. We'll sort it out. Hey, Bereka. Grab all the, all the other items. Which is not much. I think that's one of the reasons why you get health so rarely in this game because if we had as many herbs as we have in RE1 <laughs> or the remake or RE2 or even hell RE3 without the box it's just unmanageable all right 
So her pistol, do I even want her pistol at this point? I don't think I do. Well, yeah, I will want it later. Shit, do I want all of this? Yeah, I do. I'm gonna stack the... The gasoline up there. So we're moving house again. Every every <laughs> once in a while in this game you're moving house. Going to another location. I only got one slot left. Oh well. I'm really thinking about dropping her pistol, but I know I'll need it. Ish. In the next part. Maybe just like... Bring, bring a shotgun with one of them. And the pistol with the other. Let's leave it for now. If I really need it, I can come back here and get it. I'll take his pistol instead. We still got the grenade launcher here. Oh well. Can I even drop some of this inside? Yeah. I'll, I'll do my best. So we had so far 12 explosive rounds, right? I think 12. 12 or 6 or 12. 12, definitely. 12 flame rounds and 6 acid rounds in the entire game. Which is, I guess that's okay. Not that it could get better. We're gonna pile that up, up there. But I did forget. Fuck, I forgot the ink ribbon. Oh, well. Hang tight, Billy. Well, let's let's loosen up a little more. These I'm gonna drop here. Oh, that's the max. That's all we can drop here. So what do you have there? He's got that. Let's. Uh, Let's exchange, Billy. Send you up there. Save up on space. So you take that instead of that. And you take... You give me that. There you go. And then go up there, boy. I'm pretty sure I can drop the hook shot after this. I think that's the last time we use it in the game. It would be nice if I had to fight something, didn't have a weapon. There we go. Okay, now we can unlock the that outside. This machine regulates power input and output. You can use this to get the cable car moving. Can we now? But where do I put the input output coil, huh? I'll just shove it in there and see what happens. We're still missing one more, right? This machine? Yeah, we're the other one is like down there. I think I I forgot it down there. The door is now unlocked. I don't know what's the point of this, like in the previous room, just like to show you that you did it, I guess. There's no reason for the animation, because it's the same room. The door's open now, you can just go through it, see? But, wow, what do I know? I'm just a gamer. Can drop that forever and ever and ever. Take that, we're gonna exchange. I think it's just quote what you're looking for. <laughs> 2021, wow. Wow. <laughs> no worries. <that laughs> 
I've done a, I had similar blunders today. It's just one of those days. When your day starts with a hailstorm, it can't really be, you know, the sexiest of days. Now we exchange further. That. You keep the Molotovs as well. He can keep some of the health. She doesn't need all this health. Like, I'm gonna leave a lot of shit on him. Magnum rounds. Do I even get the Magnum by that point? I don't think I do, so... I'm not using them on the Tyrant anyway. Because I got something better for the Proto Man. Proto Tyrant. Oh, Hydrate. Thanks, sis. <laughs> I instantly thought of Metalocalypse. <laughs> Hailstorm is metal. <laughs> I want the Ink Ribbons. I really wanted to not come back to the room, but. Destiny would not permit me. I'm just gonna give Billy Rebecca's uh, crappier gun now. Well, now crappier. Her Stars Edition. <laughs> Hailstorm. Oh, okay. That's the first thing I had in mind was Nathan <laughs> Nathan saying that. Are we good, inventory management simulator? We're gonna be good. I don't think I can drop anything else on the floor here. Well I did pick up I did pick one thing up. So let's 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 do the switcheroo now. Billy, you keep the Molotovs. I'm gonna take your pistol because I'm soloing this part. Take your bullets, all of them. Take the ink ribbon, all of it. What else can he keep that I don't need right now? He can take some of the health. She's not gonna need all this health and she's gonna make more so it's just gonna be harder to carry it around. You know, this is something I've never done before this way. So right now we have three of these here. Wow, that's a lot. Three, and we got two on them. We're doing good with health. I think this is five. This is the best I've ever been with health in this game, honestly. It's and it's on stream. I mean, when it's you know, it's usually it's different when you're doing when I'm doing it with myself like this, and then like thinking sometimes for five minutes, and then my <laughs> I lose my train of thought, and I'm like thinking about hmm, have I paid that bill? Well, what the fuck was I doing? Oh yeah, inventory, but. Uh, this is this was really good. All right, Barak is gonna need or well, whatever she needs. She needs it fast. Where is that thing? I know it's ah, there it is on the right there. The output regulation coil, which is a thing, I guess. <laughs> so we can drop some items here now. Necessary to get the cable car moving again. We're even gonna drop the ink ribbon here. We're gonna be moving house, like I said, so. Go back up. It would be nicer that if it, it, if it were the same room, but without the loading screen every time. But the game was already hitting the limits. Technological kind, I mean. What is that on the ground? Is that ink ribbon? No, that's... Is that a... Oh, that's the that's the hook shot. We're not gonna need that any... Any more or any less. Okay, that's what I forgot. Okay. 
So you can you probably smell this uh, if you ever seen RE2 original. It kind of looks similar. Well, not similar, almost identical. Can I bring two more things down there? I do have two slots. As long as I don't have to come back here later again for more shit. I'll be very grateful. Cut down all the travel time. It's a puzzle game. <laughs> like really, it's a puzzle game. As in, even the, the navigation and item <laughs> inventory... Like item inventory? Inventory management is uh, a puzzle. Okay, what are we dropping? We're drop Well, nothing really. This is how I want to proceed. Yep. Yeah? Yeah. Here we go, Bereka. Come on. Okay. What does he got? He doesn't need anything. Pistol. Okay. I gave him three herbs and I got two more and one more here. Yeah, we're good. Is it time? Are we ready? I think I'll be good with this because I got the grenade launcher, yeah. And then we're doing the hunter as well. And the power's out. Like, what else do you want from me? Run, 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 run. He's got quite a reach. Fuck, he's very good. That, that went well. That went really well. Leon! <laughs> oh, look at my love. She knows this stuff. Do it right away. You earned it, Rebecca. Also, I'm too lazy to carry all this shit. So, that went as good as it could have, really. I gotta redo everything. Someone's undoing my work. It's really rude, guys. Step on his children. <laughs> let none survive. All right, we we'll let none survive. Put it back in. They couldn't even carry it somewhere, you know, further away. But as we know, these leeches know what they're doing. They're doing what they're doing with uh, with a purpose. Okay. So what, you know what, we're carrying everything. Yeah, that's where the Magnum is. Not gonna use it still though. It's very good for the final battle. But I'm gonna touch it. Cause it's on this dead soldier that definitely it's not gonna zombify. He's got a Magnum on it. What if I go use, there is no check. There we go, we tagged it. Now we drop shit. Now we pile everything in here. Everything that we can. Can you explore even? Nah. She doesn't care about any of this. Whatever you do though, <coughs> do not start it up yet. Anything else? Well, I mean, I could drop the, these and bring more shit in. Maybe even do it all in one trip.
Oh yeah, we don't have Billy anymore. That's right. If you haven't noticed, Billy is gone. Billy! Billy! Monsieur Billy. I get why people, you know, find this tedious. It is tedious. But in the grander scheme of things, you know, I get it. Still, we're having a backpack or something you can carry around. You know, unable to fight or something like that while you do that. That would be really good. So you can bring all the items once you clean, you know, once you clear the road of obstacles. And when I say obstacles, I mean the undead. You know what I mean. <laughs> what the fuck is that? What, Billy? No, of course I want Billy back. You would think I want to play with Rebecca. Rebecca, the uh, looking at the zombie, not shooting. My face is getting bitten. Ow, so rude. Stop it. I'm still not going to shoot, Rebecca. Of course I want to play with Billy. Rebecca's just silly sometimes. All right, those two. And then pick up your gun. Well, Billy's gone, really. <laughs> they did make her more passive, docile. And, you know, it makes sense. I get why they did it. It's her character. She's a rookie. She's not really cool with all the zombies eating her face. I wouldn't be either. Oh, yeah, but we did that already. Look, Billy's gone from the inventory. He's gone. Goodbye, Billy. We missed you, buddy. But we'll miss you. Well, this is pretty good. We got enough items. A lot of the HP items are on Billy. Billy, who's swimming with the fishes right now. If we need, if we, if it turns out we need that uh, hook shot again, it's gonna be really funny. A little maddening, but funny. Just spray and hook shot up there. Just blew her up and ink ribbon there. We don't care. We don't care. We don't care. Everything that I need is in the tram. Let's check the other maps. Train. Well, that, the train's derailed. That's destroyed. Training facility. Shit, 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 shit. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Shit. Okay. No, don't get out of the map. Sorry I insulted you. Seven bullet shotgun. Facility basement. Nothing. 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 Alright. Laboratory. Which is where we are now. So this is it. Alright. A char... Wait. A charge! Oh, wow, it's already... Jeez. All right. Can't believe <laughs> I'm having so much fun with this game. Time is just flying. Start the cable car. Yeah. That's it. What do you, what do you think... Where do you think this is gonna end up? You got you got you got three guesses where it's gonna end up. <laughs> kind of familiar. Oh boy, now we gotta. You know what? I got what I need. I'll just leave everything here for now, and I'll take things as I need them. Two greens. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, what are we dropping? We're dropping the ink ribbon. We keep the shotgun and the pistol. Both this time.
combine. There you go. All right. That leaves us with a slot. <laughs> Not much, but better than nothing. Is there a red here or something? It says something there, but I can't read it. It almost looked like Cyrillic. Like Russian, Bulgarian, Serbian. Man, I can't tell if that's Latin or Cyrillic. It could be both. Almost like it says happy in Serbian. <laughs> Show Shireland. Will I be able to come back here? Or did I not fuck up? Once I... Well, let me think. Once I get out of here... Oh, I'm not gonna find out. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not gonna be blocked in, I'm sure. So let's go. I should have brought some health. I remember what's downstairs. Oh, never mind. Oh my, look where we are. It's so unfamiliar. Where could this be? Oh no, gee, oh wow. Look, it's the lab from RE2. What they now call the nest, apparently. Even the same room. I've, I so wanted to think this is one of the other hangars. You can think, you can see it in the background. In, in this game, in Outbreak, in RE2. You can see there are other hangars. This is what, number 7? 15, I forgot. It has a number. Oh, yes, yes. Ink ribbon, we'll take that later. It's tightly sealed. So this is, what, two months before RE2. Some worker helmets. I guess we got here when no one was still working. So we know that the catastrophe didn't happen in the lab below yet. It won't for another two months. Cabinet door is open. There's nothing left inside the cabinet. Oh, I expected a more complex word after that. It's a control panel. There's a keyhole. A keyhole. We got the map of the factory. Yeah, okay, so we got only those floors for now. Good, good. That makes sense. Ah, here we go. Here comes the bullshit. So we'll leave that for the next episode, actually. Apparently, because I'm not going to finish it tonight, definitely. But tomorrow, that's it. It's guaranteed. I always, have you ever wondered what's behind those barrels in RE2 and Outbreak? Well, now you know. <laughs> there was a whole other department here. Of the factory. I left that inside, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I left it inside. What did I want? I wanted the explosives. Take all that outside. Even drop it here, you know? There you go. Alright, let's go back up. So quiet, suddenly all the music is gone. I, I, I get what they were doing though. Maybe some uh, ambient sounds would be nice. Or you know that music that was uh, in front of the church? On the bridge? That would go really well with this area as well. So what are we doing? 35, 37 and yeah, we'll be good. Time to save. What is this? Save number six. Very good.
can't believe how much I'm enjoying this. I'm still like it's very good. Like I like I said, uh, who did I s tell that yesterday? I think it was in in Carter's friend's stream. It's so nice that I have more games to appreciate now than I used to have. Usually it's the other way around, you know. You you feel like you grow. What what's the expression? Grow um, out of some things. <gasps> Here we go. Michelle is doing Dino Crisis. Let's see. Is this the fresh list, Twitch? Thank you. Thank you for watching. Dino, I love Dino Crisis. So, Snoopka, if you don't remember, we were kids, but Dino Crisis is also a Capcom game. It's Resident Evil with dinosaurs. Two games. We don't count the third one. Both amazing in their own right. I like both games, honestly. They're different. But yeah. Hopefully I'll get that someday again. So here we go. We're gonna raid uh Mr. Michelle. Michelle's Michelle Sweet. <laughs> I call him Michelle Sweet. But yeah. Thanks everyone for watching again. Lovely stream as always. Bye. Tomorrow conclusion. You know everything. Till next time. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, family. Bye.